Welcome to the fresh catch of the day. Ready, steady, go. And now, here's your host, Peter Everett. <laughs> Hi Australia, hi everybody and welcome to Ready Steady Cook where two super talented chefs make four scrumptious meals, all of that in just 20 minutes. Now along with the, for the ride today are two studio contestants, of course they're armed with those five magical ingredients. Well let's meet our scrumptious chefs today. The very tall and handsome, <clears throat> and he's very talented as well, Dang Street Depot Executive Chef Jared Ingersoll everybody. <laughs> Hey, big guy. You're up in An executive chef, Brett Swarth. He's tall. He's at. Ah. It's Alastair McLeod. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Come here, you. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Swing us off. So, what's the most unused ingredient? Uh, Even underused. Underused. I'd probably say salt. Um, a good quality salt. But a, a lot of people have got, have got a fear of seasoning the foods. They think salt's bad, but in fact, you know, it, it, a little bit of salt just enhances food immensely. It does. And it's just, you know, don't go not too, too much. Not too much, just enough to bring. Molden's the... good. Molden's good. Hello, Molden people. It's not salt that's bad for you. It's too much salt, you know. Yes. I would say to you, my, my, my ingredient I would say would be potatoes. All the kids aren't eating potatoes these days. Too many carbs. In Ireland, though, that's all there is in the centre of the table. Potatoes, potatoes, potatoes. Really? Yes. It's a and shame. Potatoes are great thing. It's grand. Oh, I miss it. You miss it, don't you? Tear in either eye. Oh, he's a very emotional person. It'll do it to you. All right, cooking with Jared on the tomato team. Please welcome the founder of a charity called Miracle Babies. It's the gorgeous Melinda. Yeah. I've got gifts for everyone. How are you? Good. Welcome. What are you? Miracle Babies. But miracle Baby gift baby? bags. No. Hello. You're on Gosh. television. There you go. It would be a miracle if I had a little baby. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> it certainly would. Hey? Can I look in this one now? Absolutely. Go for it. What's Bring the charity out. about? I can feel a kicking. Miracle babies. <laughs> Is that called a false pregnancy? That's scary. Oh, yeah. Who's the daddy? Oh, <laughs> That'd be amazing. There you go. There Let's we go. Ready. Let's have a look I in the bag. Some goodies. What's the charity all about? If you're okay, we support um, premature and sick newborns and their families, uh -huh. and we also raise funds for um, newborn intensive care units. Oh, fantastic! So, it is great. Good on you. We're going to find a lot more about that later. We'll Absolutely. talk in depth. Absolutely. Fabulous. Yep. I love that. Now, what have you got in your bag here? Okay. And thank you for your gifts. That's okay. You're welcome. That? Lots oh. of lots of yummy stuff. Big flat mushrooms. Goodness. Oh. They're meat Rockets. for vegetarians. <laughs> Shredded mozzarella. <laughs> Carrots. Gosh, they're excitable, <laughs> this audience. Pork fillets. <laughs> la, la, la. Poor little babe. Anyway, we're here now. So, you're a good cook? Oh. I try. Are you ever? I try. <laughs> You're terrific. Now, you brought someone to play with today, uh, haven't absolutely. you? Absolutely. My partner in crime and Maruka Baby's Vice President, Naomi Raw. So, please welcome Melinda's friend who runs, helps run the charity Miracles Baby, Miracle Babies. It's Naomi. Yeah. How are Hello. you? Good, thank you. Good. Lovely to have you here. Thanks. Hello, Hi. Naomi. Hello. Hello. Good, thank you. So, how did you get involved? Um, I was with the actually, charity? I actually had uh, my second son in hospital yep. um, and the social worker approached me and said that there was another lady, Melinda, um, interested in starting a charity. So, um, yeah, we met, met then. You never know how life turns out, no, where it's going to take not. us. What a great blessing yes, for is. all of us. Very much it's so. wonderful. Good job, you two girls. Thank you. Now, what is in here? Classic okay. bag. Good things. We have some snow peas. Sprouts. Yes. <laughs> sprouts, yes. Chicken breast? Yep. <laughs> Shush! Out of the yard, quickly. Close that gate. Some zucchini. We got chickens. Some apples. <laughs> Lovely apples. And my favourite cheese, halloumi. Halloumi. Oh, yeah. We love a bit That's of good. halloumi. Yeah, you're a good cook as well. Um, I do try as well. You do try. Do you watch the show? <laughs> I do. You must be an excellent chef. Like this one. No, not you, her. Oh. <laughs> now, over here, what do we come up with, kids? Exciting? Oh, I'm so excited. You are. You look excited. 
I am. I do. <laughs> I'm containing it well. Now I'm going to let my excitement spill over, and I'm going to um, use it to s s season these pork loins. Yep. The spice little number on the. You're looking at me funny. I'm a strange person, don't worry about <laughs> okay. that. And then I'm going to barbecue them. I'm going to serve yeah. them with some uh, candied carrots. So yep. I'm going to cut these really fine beautiful. and just fry them with a little bit of sugar Julian, and salt. Yeah. Julian, yeah. Julian style. Mm -hmm. right. These mushrooms are really beautiful. So what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to make a mushroom pie. But this is going to form, it's going to be a little bit different. I'm going That's to have the... the well, this is going to form the top of the pie. And then it's going to have pastry underneath. And then Very I'm going to clever. fill the pie with some of the, the cheese and, and a few other bits and pieces. Mm. I'm going right. to do a, um, a dish called a gratin, which is, and that's going to consist of some uh, beans and chickpeas and pork uh, that I'm going to cook in a pan, cover it with breadcrumbs, then bake that in the oven. Oh, and then delicious. on top of that, I'm going to serve a little rocket salad. Yeah. This is good rocket. food. Oh, it's good food. Very clever. Excellent. And then to wind up, I'm going to make a carrot cake. A carrot cake? Yeah. In 20 minutes, as well as doing everything else. That's and right. perhaps a couple more if I have time. There you go. <laughs> oh, he's just showing off now. Here we go, over here. Hi, Ted. Peter Everett, Peter, Naomi and myself mm -hmm. are going to prepare uh, four dishes. We're going to do um, a zucchini and halloumi fritters. Mm -hmm. And we're going to serve oh, that... like those? We're going to serve that with some fresh pesto. I've inveigled Naomi, into Na Naomi and Peter into making that. What do you call the Teddy? Peter. We named him Peter while we were there talking to Jared oh. and Melinda. I'm going to do a grilled chicken uh, um, and halloumi stack. Do I look like that bear? No, you're cuddly. No, because you're cuddly and you wear tight-fitting clothes. <laughs> um, we're going to do a gr grilled halloumi uh, and uh, chicken stack with a tomato <laughs> and the all-over body hair. <laughs> okay, off me for a moment. Back to the television show. With a, with a tomato salsa. Um, I'm not a hairy person like a bull bear, and I don't look like that. Am I wearing my clothes too big or too small? Just look, have a wee close up there. Oh, I'll stop it. I'll do some zucchini wrapped chicken. I'm going to wrap the, 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 the chicken up in zucchini. Do the wrap. And serve that with some uh, um, walnut, um, walnut. I don't know where that came from. Wilted shoots. Wilted shoots? Yes, Peter. Naomi, Peter. And for dessert, we're going to do toffee apple barrels. <gasps> and serve them with a brandy cream. Oh, now you've got them. Teddy's really inspired you today, hasn't he? <laughs> eh? Bit of a bear. OK, well, before we can kick off the show, everyone, we know what we have to say, audience, don't we? The magical words. Ready, steady, cook, start cooking. That's a true cut with our chefs are going to be cooking in their kitchens. Firstly, with Jared and lovely Melinda there for the tomato side. The barbecued pork with the candy carrots, the mushroom and mozzarella pie. Also, the bean and pork gratin with the rocket salad. And Jared is attempting to make a carrot cake and will do so. And for Alistair and the lovely Naomi, for the capsicum team, we have the zucchini and the halloumi cheese fritters with pesto, the grilled chicken and halloumi stack with tomato salsa, the zucchini wrapped chicken breast with wilted shoots, and for dessert, the toffeed apple barrels with brandied cream. Can you believe it? We'll see. <laughs> I know you're attempting a lot, I would have thought. I know that, Peter. I know that, Peter Everett. Um, First we're going to be back here in a short moment to see what you're going to be doing. Oh, what are you going to do in our break? Because we've got a short break. I'm going to start to prepare the zucchini yes. ribbons. Yep. There you go. I'll tell you what, time is running away from us here, everyone. We haven't even seen the main body of work. It has not yet begun. What are these chefs doing? Will they complete the task, we ask? Come back and find out. Pretty, pretty quick.